Chicago Community with Pastor Bruce. I wanted to let you know something that just has happened here just in the last uh, couple weeks. We've been talking about it. An opportunity as the schools started uh, getting ready to meet back again and their plans and, and distance learning and all of that. And one of the suggestions was made that we might want to consider providing space. Uh, a learning center, if you will. We've, we've called it, as you can see on the sign, El Camino Learning Center this way. And uh, we've got it up on our pods. What happened was, as we started talking about what we could do, uh, we said, well, we've got a lot of space. If we've got students that uh, parents are not home, uh, and they got to be at work, and yet their kids have to be at a place, and uh, they weren't necessarily comfortable being at school, or whatever the case may be. So, uh, just we over the last two weeks, our staff put together this idea and started making the plans, and and uh, we've got we've made this space. The students have just left. And it's uh, three thirty in the afternoon. It's, it's open from from uh, seven thirty to three thirty, and so that's D Pod, and you come on over here and C Pod, and we've got it opened up. And uh, you can see uh, now that, as I said, they've all just left. But um, we've got tables and chairs, and you'll notice all the chairs are, you know, six feet apart. And the students come in and have their uh, laptops with them. And some of them have masks and wearing masks if they choose. And, and here we, we've got space. These are the, we've got two people uh, that are uh, volunteering at the time. And, and it goes kind of in segments. So we've got groups, two people that'll volunteer in the morning and then two people that volunteer in the afternoon and come in and just be monitors. They're not, they're not teaching, they're not doing lessons. They're just here just to make sure everything's okay. And then this is the break room. And so we've got some snacks for them and because the schools have different schedules and the kids will take a break and, and come here and have a break or they can go on outside for a minute. And, uh, but I thought you might wanna know uh, this is what you're doing. This is what El Camino is doing, uh, taking an opportunity as it shows up to, to do something good for our community and our neighbors. Uh, Hebrews chapter 13, verse 16 says, And do not forget to do good and to share with others, for with such sacrifices God is pleased. Um, we can't do everything, but there are some things we can do. And we can reach out and uh, be a part of our community and help our community and help the families and the kids. And we appreciate people who are volunteering and doing it. And by the way, if you want to be involved in that, you can sign up. You can contact Danny and, uh, at the office and he'll get you on a schedule if you'd like to take a day there. Uh, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, uh, whatever the case may be and you want to take a day and uh, maybe a section of the day and come and just be here. You can bring your laptop, do your work, uh, whatever you want to do. Uh, to hang out and be a part and get to know some of these students and families. See you soon, church. Bye.